um quick recap of last episode i'm pretty sure we went to the nether and uh, we found like a bastion in the nether and whatnot i can't really show it right now but we went to the nether we found the bastion and then we also found this like weird building that has blazes in it um and i think the only other thing we did last episode was enchant stuff so we did get a pretty good pickaxe that has unbreaking fortune efficiency and vein mining Yo, Taylor Alexis with the 18 w months. Community, w streamer W modded Minecraft series. Appreciate that. W Prime. Appreciate you. W's in the chat for Taylor. Oh, yeah. So we got some enchants. We got a pretty good pickaxe. Um, we named our sword Pookie. Because for some reason, y'all have been saying Pookie a lot this series. Not sure what's up with that. Um, but yeah. So I think this episode, um, we're going to go back to that weird skeleton area that we left off last night in the last episode. And then I think we're also going to expand our farm a little bit because I feel like we keep running out of food. I feel like it would definitely be helpful to do that. And maybe we'll work on some stuff with the house. But one in the chat if y'all want to go to that skeleton place that we left off last episode first or two if y'all want to do the farm farm is building skeleton place is exploration make a cow farm oh we do actually need an animal farm we do kind of need an animal farm all right i see all ones except for maybe a couple yo geo appreciate the bear Okay. All right, so let's get the stuff we need. I'm pretty sure we put everything up from last episode in this box. Um, so we should have all the stuff from there. But do we have a shield though? I don't know what happened to our shield, actually. Not in the backpack. Hey, Crip, how are you? How's the fam? I hope you're having an amazing night. I'm doing all right. Appreciate you asking. Fam is good as well. Hope you're doing good. Maybe I'm bugging. I don't know what happened to our shield. Oh my gosh. I, I just found our shield. Anyways, though, is there anything else that we need? Yo, Kim Possible with the 100 bits. Appreciate that. And Caitlin with the resubscription W two months. Appreciate you. That was in chat for Caitlin and Kim Possible. Uh, I feel like we need more food. And then I don't think there's anything else we need, right? Just food. Maybe blocks. I was gonna stack of blocks. Yo, Bella with the hundred bits as well. Appreciate you, Bella. Blocks and torches. Torches is a good idea. I don't know if we have any more torches, but I think we have we have some coal and then some sticks. Boom. Alright, so we got a couple torches. I think that was it, right? Some more food. We'll just grab apples. Uh, we could turn these to gold apples, right? Y'all think gold apples are worth it? I never use them, but we just have a ton of apples right now. We do have gold. Chat, everyone say happy birthday to Cryptic. It's his 32nd birthday. Who, who told you that? Chat, everyone say happy birthday to Cryptic. It's his 32nd today. It was supposed to be low key. But thank you. Appreciate that. I didn't get any cake today, so. All right. Um, how do you make a golden apple? I'm guessing you just put the apple and then wrap it. Yep. Okay, so we can make like three golden apples. I don't know how helpful that is, though. Yo, Jasmine with the thousand bit. Yo, that y'all don't gotta. You know what I'm Happy saying? Happy birthday, mines tomorrow. Happy pre 
early birthday, Caitlin. Appreciate that. Um, appreciate the thousand bits. Happy pre birthday. Okay, chat. Y'all are sending a lot of stuff right now off rip. I appreciate y'all. Y'all don't need to send nothing, bro. It's cool. Thank you for everyone sending gifts, subs, all that, bro. Appreciate y'all, man. Okay. W birthday scam. All right. So let's make one more apple and I think we're good to go. Do we have enough for another? We do. Is this cheating? Oh, I just realized I think it's pulling out of this. It's just not updating. Or is it? Yeah, it was pulling out of the goal we had in here. I see. Okay, well, that's enough apples. I feel like that should be a good enough amount of food. All right. Let's do it. So we left off. I don't remember what I named the thing. Is it bone? It is. Okay. So I know how to one. make golden apples now. TKS. Yeah, I'm not even gonna lie. That's the first time I made golden apples. So if that just helped you learn, then I'm glad I could help you. All right. So last episode, we came in here. We looked around for a little bit. And there was actually some good loot, but there was a ton of skeletons. Um, so we kind of like pulled out of the area a little bit. Yo, Jamal Cryptic with the BTW, the Nuggets have lost one game. So if they go undefeated for the rest, Tyler Water Dance Cities, go Nuggets. I never agreed to that. Lakers and seven question mark. It's definitely not happening but all right so i think we need to light the area up or something because we went through all of this yesterday uh, maybe i can light this spawner up you should try going to the ever bright dimension this stream more info on the quest book happy 55th birthday unk 55th birthday okay i am not i'm not that old i don't know who told you i was 55 all right let's look through this thorns that's pretty good is it not oh no okay this is not good. So I need to figure out how, where these skeletons are like coming from. There's just so many of them. Uh, more golden apples. Nice. Got some bones and some redstone. More golden apples. Okay. So far, I want to say this place has the best loot that we've seen so far out of any place curse of binding that that's like the worst thing you can possibly get right we definitely don't want that right big fan keep doing what you're doing appreciate that dude where did that Okay, Casper's in this vault as well with us. Got it. All right. That's odd. All right, let's keep looking around. I think there's another room above us. So maybe there's more loot in here as well. But I think after we get done clearing this area out, we'll um, enchant some, some stuff with the books that we got. Ha 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 P by E E X D E. Where are these skeletons coming from? Okay. All right. Um, let me put the apple over here. Uh, 
I think we need like what is that? What is that? It had like a red bow. All it's one of the dudes with the hats. Oh no. Okay, this is not good. I couldn't even eat the apple. All right, well, we're going back to eat our stuff. Yo, How he's, old you is? Uh, 35. 35, man. Appreciate the 100 bits. All right, let me bring... What do we need to bring just in case? We should have put the, um, what's it called? The XP and the tome thing. So we didn't lose XP there, but it's all good. I'll just get a sword and a chest plate. And that should be good enough. I don't think we need anything else. So I'm pretty sure like 90% positive we get a new hat if we pack that dude up, right? Oh wait, I'm going the wrong place. More food. Uh, we'll probably just have to pick it up off our body. Torches. We do need more torches, but I don't know if we have any. Let me check. Hey, Daddy and Chat, how are we doing tonight? Uh, pause. I'm doing all right, though. Let's get Ace. Okay. We'll bring 24 torches. That should be good. But well, I'm guessing we get get a hat if we pack that dude up weird thing is though that dude had a red sword and a red bow which is i've never seen that and i don't remember the first guy having that you're 35 you look 22 appreciate the compliment man yo l appreciate the uh three tiktoks and stuff appreciate the 10 ggs hopefully this dude's not just standing on our body because uh, I don't think we're going to get our loot back if he is. Okay. Looks clear. Oh, oh, no. Day four right. of saying R.I.P. Lucky the horse, Craig the turtle, Jamal the frog, all the baby sea turtles, Max the dwarf rabbit, Peter the firefly, all the sheep you could have protected from the creeper, and all the helpless villagers. All right, um, that guy's gone, and we did get a new hat, W hat. I'll put it on once we leave this area so it doesn't like break. But there's still a bunch more stuff in here we need to find. But I'm just not sure like where all these skeletons are coming from. I think they're just dropping from above. I'm gonna start lighting some stuff up in here. Wait, where did the, where did the, um, oh, here they are, torches. All right, so we're just going to light up as much as we can for a second, so that way maybe the skeleton stops spawning. So I think I came in on this side, so I'm gonna block this off. But I know I've already looted this. And then we have not looted this yet, so let's see what's in here. What's Above. good, Cryptic? Are you doing the supermarket simulator today? I miss um, Bill. Sad face, sad face. Probably not today. I think we're just doing some craft today. Okay, so we got smites. Uh, let me put some stuff in the backpack. Okay, move all this stuff in here. Okay. And then we also got Marksman, which I've never seen before. Allows bows to retrieve arrows from backpack. This will also work with other shootable items. 
W3 months cryptic and you need to change your game title on Twitch. What's the title? Appreciate the uh, three month resubscription as well. Appreciate that, man. Is not title uh, episode 11? Or am I tripping? Supermarket is the title? Oh, we are on the wrong category. Thank you. Thank you for letting me know that. Where are you from? Uh, I'm from Kansas. Grew up in Kansas, but I live in Texas. Okay, so. Loyalty three. Okay. There is a lot of loot in here. This is definitely the best place of loot that I've seen personally so far. All right, let's block off the spawner. Do we just need one torch for this to work or do you have to use the whole thing around it? I don't remember. String, iron, bones. Bread. We got smite and looting. Looting is pretty good. The whole thing. TikTok chat says one. Twitch says the whole thing. Alright, what's in here? Bone meal. There's a lot of bows in here with infinity. Uh, we got flame and blast protection. That's pretty good, actually. If we do like um, TNT or whatnot. Power. Uh, not bad loot in here, man. All right, so we went through both of those. Get top. Oh my gosh. There's another spawner here. Alright, let's see what's in here. Arrows. Wouldn't the arrows of swiftness, wouldn't this give them speed or something? Or am I bugging? I feel like that would help them. Smite, I don't think we need that book. What happened to all your netherite weapons? Now oh, this is a whole different series. So the first one was vanilla, and then this is a modded series. You can shoot yourself with the arrows. What? I didn't know that was a thing. Okay, boom. Bones. Honestly, at this point, the only things that are good are apples and uh, books. Fortune 2 is not bad. Flame. I think we have one of those. I don't think we have a luck at a C book, so we'll take that. All right. Stack the arrows. Which ones? I think they're all stacked, right? Oh, and the quiver. I don't know if we... We don't even have our quiver on, do we? Yeah, these are all different arrows, so we'll just have to put them up when we go back. like the spider-man meme are all just like pointing at each other okay all right 
I think this entire area is looted now. Besides this one spot. And over here. You have normal arrows in the backpack inventory. Yeah, but we don't have um, normal arrows here though. To stack them, I don't think. Unless I was missing arrows. Appreciate that, Hydrate. Yo, what's good? Is this a mod pack? It is. It's called Better Minecraft. Oh, thank you. Unbreaking 2, that's pretty good. We've gotten a lot of these smite books from here. I guess we can grab that. Um, Another apple. Grab the disc. Okay. A mending bow. What do y'all think is better, a mending or infinity? I feel like the infinity is better because we had a mending bow last series, but just being able to shoot unlimited arrows is kind of good because you can always repair it, right? You can combine them in an anvil. I think that's only on a uh, bedrock. Or maybe because this is the modded one, we can actually do both. And then where's the other one at? Okay. All right, let's see what's in here. Arrow of leaping. Okay. Ooh, looting three. That's that's actually really good. Uh, we can draw a bone mule. Got another disc. All right, we're pretty much stacked here. We should probably take this stuff back. Let's see if there's anything else in here before we leave. Okay, we got another chest, more iron, bucket, another smite. Is there anything I can stack? this disc where that smite book go eat the bread good idea thank you all right i think that is everything here um this is actually a pretty good spot i would say by far this is the best loot we found in a building i kind of want to break the spawners to get the the spawner fragment stuff or gloves in our cape thank you that should give us a little bit more space there we go thank you y'all think i should leave the spawners here so we can come back and like get xp from the skeletons or i should break them so we can make more spawners the only thing is like, I don't know how to get those soul things. Apparently we can get souls and make our own XP or our own spawner. Then we'll break like, oh, we got two of those things here. We'll break a couple of them, but leave like one or two. That way there's still a spawner in here at least. be the only spawner there's one over there oh my gosh oh that's the big dude again all right that's all i needed to see take the special arrows they're good for boss fight um considering we're like stacked to the brim on loot right now might just have to come back for those but that is a good idea barrels on the chair near the fire all right i'll come back and get the special arrows and then check that barrel if i didn't already check it uh, let's put some of this stuff up for now 
Okay. We have like a bajillion books. I don't know what to use on what, if anything. Um, I'm gonna put up books that aren't probably helpful at all right now. I think that's all the books, honestly. And then we have a ton in our backpack too. It shows the weapon? Oh, I didn't see that. I did not see that. Thank you. So we have Silk Touch. I think we should definitely make a Silk Touch pickaxe. That'll probably be helpful. Um, And then we also have a looting... Looting 3 book, I think. Yeah, Looting 3. Which I think we can put on our sword, right? Sword, looting. All right, we don't have enough levels for that. Do y'all think it's worth it? To put looting on a sword? Defense skin goes hard, appreciate that. The purple book is about to break. I think this is just the, um, the XP that's in it. So when I fill it up, it gets like the stuff in it. And then if I take it away, then it does that. It is worth it. Put it on the pickaxe. I'm pretty sure pickaxe is only fortune, right? Yeah, so looting is swords and then fortune is... Or no, yeah, looting is swords, fortune is pickaxe. I think that's right, right? So we need to go get a couple more levels then. Honestly, we can probably just find something to fight out here and that should level us up. We probably only need like a skeleton or a creeper or a zombie. Okay, villager. I don't know if we have a weakness potion. Jose with the 41 months. Was up cryptic, how's your day been? Husband, chill. How's your day been, man? Oh, wait, chat, we got it. Appreciate that, Zay. W's in chat for Zay. Big 41 months, man. I think that's a soul. It is. Let's go. Um. So this dude says summoner. I don't know what that is, but maybe we can save him. How did you get rid of the snow? It's, I guess it's summer here, but the ice hasn't went away. Um, all right, so what do we need to save him? Isn't it a weakness potion? If we don't have it, we probably won't save him. We do have a weakness potion. Uh, um, let me just put this up in here for now so I have enough space. So golden apple and weakness potion. And that's it, right? And then a boat maybe? To keep them like still? disappeared i think that happened last time we seen a, a zombie villager they just like disappear if i walk away it could still be here let me see or did he just turn into the witch i don't know if that's how that works or not because he's definitely nowhere near us i don't think I feel like he just turned into that witch. Back of the house? Yo, who, why are these guys on top of our house? I 
I don't see him over here. I think he just disappeared, to be honest. That is the second time we wanted to save someone and they just disappeared. Okay. So I do want to see what this does. The spawner thing. Because we had inactive spawners we made, right? But we didn't have a soul to put inside of it. I think we should make a little room that has a spawner and see if it works. Lag. Is it still lagging? Are y'all good or is it lagging? Might have been the ones on the roof I saw on the map, I bet. Okay, it's good now. Alright, as long as it's not like super lag. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna build out a tiny little room. And then we're just gonna put the spawner thing in there. And see if it works. I feel like it should. I think it just said we need a, a soul to activate it. like a little maybe five by five room it should be big enough and then just make the roof go up like one or two also we definitely need to make um what is the other thing called the um the pickaxe the silk touch pickaxe that way we don't have to like smelt the the cobblestone and stuff. All right, let's block this off. Do one layer higher for this. And then this should be a good little starter area for our spawner thing. Hopefully it works. One in the chat if you think it's actually gonna work. Two if y'all think this is definitely not gonna work. I don't really know. I've never seen it before. I think it should though, right? I'll put it here and then like block it off like this, maybe. Alright, yo, Caroline with the 10 stream streak W10. Okay, so here's the spawner. We got the soul. Ta-da! Hey! Let's go! Alright, so we got an unlimited zombie spawner. I don't know what to do with it. I don't know how we can make this, like, beneficial. But... That's pretty cool. Is this a realm or a server? Oh, this is just a solo let's play. You could put water so it pushes them forward. Okay. I like that idea. Um, do we have a bucket? I need to put this lava somewhere. Baby zombies will get out. Is there any way to keep that from happening or no? Half slabs? Okay. Or gates, got you. Cause we can still hit through the gates, right? Why do I put water there and in the other corner? this work all right I think it works so we made a zombie spawner 
That's cool. I don't I don't feel like it'll give us that much XP, but is there um some just shot at me? Yo, turtle with the resubscription. W two months, man. Appreciate the resubscription. Make the room bigger, do half slabs so babies won't get out. Bigger room means more spawning. Got you. Okay. We can do that. That should be enough slabs. And then we'll put this back. We need to put up a lot of this stuff. Um, while we're here, though, put our sword in and get the looting. Boom. Looting three. So we do need to get mending, though. And, uh, yeah, we need to get mending books for our pickaxe and our sword. Because both of these are actually really good. And if they get low, then we probably need to just put them up. Check it once in a while, because if you let it go, they'll keep spawning and make the game slow. Because there's so many. Got you. Alright, so... Boom. Let's put this here for now. Oh, no. But how big should a room be then? I can't sub today. Sorry, to love the streams. All good. Glad you enjoy the streams. To make it more proper, clear out 10 blocks in every direction around the spawner and put water at the very bottom to push them to a hole so they take fall damage. Once they fall about nine blocks, just one tap them to save your sword and the spawn rate is better. Okay. So the only issue with that is I don't think, I don't think we can break our spawner. Cause I don't know if the silk touch works or not on it. So should we just make the room bigger for now? Oh, we can just leave it there and just make the room bigger. Uh, we do not have any torches, I don't think. We got one. Boom. Okay, so y'all said nine blocks in each direction. Yo, Daisy, appreciate the bear. I cannot see your name, but I appreciate the necklace, man. Four from the spawner, and it works just as good. All right, so that's four this way. Two, three, four. So this will be where we like get them at, I guess. Uh, well, should we do the thing where we make the them go down in the water? In the hole or no? One in the chat if we should make them fall in a hole. Two if we should just keep it as the basic room. Because I don't know what I'm doing with the water, but we can figure it out. All right, I see all ones. Exclamation mark TTS, I saved up all my points. You're one of my favorite streamers. Keep doing what you're doing every time you stream air makes my day. Hope you had a great day. Blue heart, blue heart. For sure, glad you enjoy the streams and I'm glad I can be a good part of your day. All right, so let's make the room as big as it needs to be first. Is that a tutorial? Okay. I think, thank you for the tutorial. We're gonna try and wing it. I think I get the general idea of what you guys are saying. Um, so let's just make a big area first. And then I think we just need to make a hole in the middle of the floor. That's nine blocks down. Right or no? Your voice is so soothing. This is what I listen to when I fall asleep. 
for sure. After you make the room, you put a hole under the spawner and put water in every corner. Just a just a one block hole? Like right under it or like a like a three by three so they can actually fall into it. So a three by three. Okay. And then we need this nine blocks down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That should work, right? And then we basically just push the water into the hole so they fall. Stop using that pickaxe. Yeah, we definitely need to get mending on it, but it's definitely gonna take a lot longer to do this if we don't use this one. I think we'll just, we need to prioritize getting a villager or something. getting out of here to be honest so uh, I think the entrance to this area was this direction oh yeah water good idea all right so then we just dig down we'll just put like a like a ladder here or something uh, so we need ladders for that. I have no idea how to make a ladder. I'm pretty sure it's sticks and something else. Sticks and a plank. Okay. Um, I don't know if we have any wood. Oh, it's in our thing that's organized now. There is ladders. Was it enough though? That's well, yeah, that's enough. W chat, appreciate y'all, man. Okay, so I'll just make a little ladder thing. And then that should work I think right one two three four five six seven eight nine so this should go to the hole yep so is this like is a zombie spawner worth it for like XP or is it kind of just for fun type thing Put slabs. I guess we don't need them actually because the water is going to push them, right? Alright, we're going to make a water thing. It's probably an off stream XP farm. Got you. Is this like beginner Minecraft stuff? Because y'all all seem to know how to do this. Like 90% of the chat knew how to do this. Uh, what do I do about the middle part? The water can't flow into the thing. Oh. Wait, I'm confused. So we need to block this off with signs so there's no water going into it. Okay, and then does it need more water? So there's not like a space in the middle? Or does the space not matter? We have 30 signs. That should do it.
Under the spawner, put the size. Okay. All right, so water in the middle spot, yay or nay? Okay, that did not work. Maybe I'm doing it wrong. I think I'm doing this wrong. Oh, they go on this one? Oh, okay. How do I make it float here, though? Let me grab his water first. I haven't used TTS in a while, but I just wanted to say I knew you were gay first. The shirtless thumbnails, now you naming swords Pookie. Interesting take. Uh, yeah, we can just go ahead and ban that person. Well, I am, um, just to let you know, I am straight. There's nothing wrong with being gay anyways if you are you know what i'm saying more power to you i'm personally not been with uh been with my girl for upwards of almost five years so and i'm uh, saying i'm definitely into kitty more than yeah anyways though but have a nice flight okay so how do we how do we put the signs down though? I just got nine ads WTF. There's no way. Put a hopper in a chest under it. And the drops flow into the hopper. Gotcha. So y'all are saying the signs need to be like here. But how do we... I'm so confused. You can place a sign on a sign if you crouch. Oh. Oh, okay. There we go. Like that? I think I think we got it. Okay, that made absolutely no sense to me. I'm so confused. What just happened? Why are we using signs? 10 by 10 cube, eight blocks deep, one block hole, two water buckets. I don't know. I'm seeing so many different things in chat on how to do this. Considering I've never done it, I'm just lost. All right, so hold on signs in the hole like this is this right if you do 10 wide you don't need signs but if you're doing four you do need signs let's test it Okay, I think it works. I don't see water. I think it's good. Also, how did water get in here? Huh? Appreciate that hydrate. Uh, all right, so this should be good then, right? Oh, the torch. 
Boom. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Oh wait, I didn't block the bottom part off, did I? Oh no. They can climb ladders? What? So, to my understanding, we just put a block here and a slab and then we just hit them. And you get XP from it. Break the torch and put a slab on top. There needs to be a slab on top of the spawner. Put the slab on top so you can see the baby zombies. I want to see him drop. I'll put a slab in this part. Right. Jesus. How was a lot better? Weren't we just slicing them through the blocks before? They all saying put slabs here. So we can see the babies. Oh my. Okay. One more try. I'm trying to, I'm trying to understand. So a block and a slab. If y'all say this is the correct thing, I'm gonna lose it, bro. Cause this is what we had the first time. Slab on the top. Oh, like that. Like this. Okay. All right. I get it. Cool. Makes sense. I didn't know if y'all was talking about when y'all said up top, I thought you guys were talking about the spawner up here. Where did this guy just come from? All right. So do we need to make it lower if they're not? They still have a lot of health. Most of them only lost like part of their health. Alright, so we need the hopper thing too, huh? So then it drops loot. Where did the carrot come from? Oh no. Alright, so we'll make it we'll make it a little bit lower. And then we should be done with this. I'm so confused on where these zombies are coming from. They're like spawning out of the room. go down here get rid of the zombies and then make it a little bit deeper and it should be good I think oh they're coming from outside all right we'll go what y'all think three lower because I think y'all are saying we don't want it to be too low because then we don't get XP right four all right this farm could be so much better you are probably right but it's our first one without looking at a tutorial which is probably why it's buttons but hey 
Okay, so this should work. Right? The block is... Oh, it's blocking the XP from getting to us. How do we get the XP to go to us? Hey, just joined for the night. How's it going? Sorry, I'm late. Oh, it's doing decent. Appreciate you asking. It's going great. Gates. Offense. If you go lower, you'll see their feet with a slab. Fence. Okay, so we just do a fence and a slab. Got it. Mm. Oh, I did not mean to put that in there. Fence. And then we had a slabs. Oh, you don't need a slab? Alright, we're just gonna try it out and see what happens. Fence. Boom. Alright. And then we're gonna break the torch. All right. I wonder if that light is going to keep them from spawning. Um, let me go get that light. Hopper. Yeah, we do need the hopper, huh? Okay, so we'll make sure this works and then we'll make a hopper. And a chest. So they're two tap, but they can hit me through the fence. We do get the XP though. So do y'all think it needs to go just one more lower? I don't know if the goal is to have them be one tap or two tap. They're two hits if they don't have armor. Three hits if they do. One more. I guess we could just jump and hit them too. That works. We just can't do like the sweep thing. Put a slab on top and put yourself down one. Ah, okay. I like this. All right, so we just need to go down one then, and it should be good. How much help they got? Oh my gosh. There's still two tap. And these guys are just like resilient. Okay. One more maybe. So what do we do? We did fence. All right. So this should work. I think. Let me see. These guys have like a ridiculous amount of health. Get rid of the slab. You stand on and only put a slab in front. Won't need a fence. What about, but the baby zombies can get through this, right? Oh, if I do one and the babies can't get through this. Oh, I see. Okay because it's not a full one by one. It's like, it's above one. Okay. There's still two tap though. 
Break four deep under the spawner and then add water again. I mean, I think it's worse, right? I think we just need it like two deeper. We're going to keep crunching it down until I see one get packed up from fall damage. Okay. It's probably different than regular Minecraft because they got enchants to like seven. Yeah, that is true. All right, so these dudes. I think we're good. I think they're one tap. I might do one more just to be safe. slabs slab here slab there now i think that works right only thing is i feel like they're not spawning like they are but it's slow oh we do need defense because we want that xp brutal watch right now <laughs> i'm trying okay all right so this is good then right you're too far down for them to spawn yeah they are not they're not spawning anymore okay all right Is this still too far? You have to make an AFK room up higher for Netum spawn. Oh, so we'll just... So whenever I do use this thing for XP, I just stand up by the top. And then let them all fall and it should be like a pile of them? Or is there a max amount? thing is working now and we still might be too too low no I hear him okay so this is the lowest we can be boom now what is the point of the slab here do I even need this one if there's a fence? I feel like there's... I mean, unless y'all know something, I, I don't see the point of the slab on the top. You don't need one? Okay. Alright, so... We should be good then, right? The babies? I don't think they can jump through the... Uh, Oh, they can't hit you if there's a thing there. All right, this is going to have to work. I think it's good, man. The spawning seems a little bit slow all of a sudden. I'm not sure why. But I, I think it works. I think we set up a spawner. Hopefully. So I'll try this out. Oops, this is too big. Zombie room. I'll try this out after this episode. And then next episode, you guys will see what I guess what happened from it. If it worked or not. I mean, it should. Made the worst spawner. Yeah, probably. But. 
first try without watching something. Okay, so what was the other thing? I think we need a silk touch pickaxe. So we need sticks. I don't know if we have diamonds. We do. Oh, we have a diamond. Never mind. Boom. Throw this in there. Brothers leaving us with a cliffhanger. Y'all want me to sit down here AFK the rest of the stream? We can have an AFK episode. Let me know. All right, so we'll put Silk Touch on this. And then I think that should be good then. We just need that. Uh, Unbreaking Fortune. We have a good sword. I don't think we need anything with our shovel. Has there been anything we found so far in this series that we wanted to grab but couldn't? Because we only had soap or we didn't have soap touch? I feel like there was something. The low lights? Oh, the, um, yeah, the stuff in the nether. Later you could add hoppers underneath and a chest that's connect so everything that drops from the mobs goes into the chest but it's better with a creeper farm for gunpowder. Got you. Okay. Yeah, we can definitely do that. Um, yeah. The purple things in the nether. Oh my gosh. Let's see if these actually break. Let's go. We got some purple things. I don't know what we're going to do with these, but. Like, I have no idea. Can these go on the ceiling? They can't. I can't think of a single build or thing that we could make that would have these all over the floor. But like, I mean, I guess they can just be a decoration. We can get this blackstone spine stuff too. An alien house? Oh, in the enchantment room. Yeah, I guess that's true. I'm pretty sure you can make waste stones with those. Uh, I don't think so. Because if I press U on stuff, it shows what we can build with it. But these have nothing. Yeah, I don't think you can make anything with those. But we could put them in our enchantment room. Do these even give light off? Oh, we can't even um, we can't place them down. They had to be on nether blocks. Thank you for reminding me to eat. Did you build it all in survival? Yeah, everything in this build has been in survival. All right, let me put all this stuff up because we have a ton of stuff right now. Are y'all sure we can put infinity and mending on a on a bow? I could have sworn that was like bedrock or something. I feel like it's definitely bedrock, but like. Yeah, that doesn't work. All right, let's get I'm going to take our infinity bow for now and then we'll bring arrows. Oh, yeah, the um, the blue hanging stuff in the caves, the glow worm stuff. I definitely want that. OK. Is there anything else we need? Let's grab pumpkin pie. Someone said we should go to the other dimension. I just don't know how we get the blocks for it. We need Everdawn blocks. I have no idea where you get those from. Everdawn has a, yeah, it doesn't even say. 
can the purple thing go in a pot? That's a good question, actually. not so these purple things are pretty much useless unless you're making a nether build that's what i'm seeing okay so i was doing something but i don't remember what it was oh the everdawn stuff how do I, I don't know what the block is for that there's a specific block we need to make the portal but i don't know where to get it from Pretty sure you can only use normal arrows for infinity. Yep, you are right. Thank you for letting me know that. It's that outside the gatekeeper's house. Okay. Oh yeah, our potatoes. Thank you. From the same house you found the other portal in. I didn't see that one there though. Unless I'm tripping. Oh, uh, we can go check there though. We still have a portal. Let me get the other arrows. And then I think we need some torches and that should be it. We have a ton of books in the backpack. Definitely gonna have to go through all these and see what's what, but for now, I'll just throw everything in there. Uh, and we could have slapped a hat on too. Punch two. Um, hats, I just put it in there, hats, and then one arrow. Boom. Nice. Check the chest, you might have some. Ever, nope. Well, here's the thing is, when I look up the Everdawn stuff in here, there's not even a block for it. It just says portal block. Whoa, this is cool. Phantom helmet? That looks pretty cool. It says it's in the twilight forest. Maybe we should go back there. You're supposed to explore until you find a villager with the portal. Okay, so then it should be at this place then. Wait a minute. I'm tripping. We've already been to the Everdawn. We haven't been to the ever bright place. That's what it is. We've been to the dawn, not the bright. I don't know how to get to the bright. Let me add, let me see if this dude knows something. If he's here. Excuse me, sir. Mr. Mickey. Dungeon key, blue journal. I was probably in the blue journal then, right? We should have that in our house. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. This journal is written to assist newcomers. Okay. Ever bright. Entrance. Portals made of turquoise stone bricks. Give him his bed back. Oh, did we snatch it? My bad. How do we get turquoise?
turquoise stone bricks. This. I have no idea where we get this from. It could, we could have it, maybe. Oh, we do have it. What? I don't remember ever picking that up, but all right. Okay, we're gonna go give this dude his bed back because I didn't mean to snatch it from him. And then we'll make the portal for this new place. Sorry about that, sir. I was just borrowing it. You have a blessed night or morning. Come. All right, so we're gonna make a little mini portal room for our fifth portal. One, two, three, four. Yeah, this will be our fifth. Um, I don't know where to put it though. I guess we can do it here. to we need to move the other portal too i kind of want to do it right here but we can't go out that far this way unless we did it like here i guess we can do it here add punch to to your bow before you go was that one of the books How wide was this? One, two, three, four, five. And this is one, two, three. So two more out. And this should be a big enough space to put the portal in. Oh, I had a bow with punch two on it. Got you. Now, what do you, for anyone who knows stuff in this mod pack, what do y'all think the best dimension is? Like for stuff to do because i've been completely lost in all of them like i don't know what i'm supposed to do in every single one of them one two three four five something's not right here twilight never nether ever dawn i guess we haven't really explored through them like that much all right, this should be good enough to put a portal here. I feel like we should put on this wall though. We have 12 blocks. Can I make this three wide? portal let's do it oh, yeah, i forgot about our soap pickaxe thank you for reminding me we use that to fix this okay let's see what is in here Ooh, got like a little sparkle thing new dimension Check your inventory tab. Uh, answer both Everbright and Everdawn. Find an Everbright portal and answer it. Okay, so same thing. Now, what did it say about the journal? What's the pig? Uh, that's a flying pig. Yo, Nick, appreciate the rose. His name is Pegasus. So we need to make a, an axe out of this stuff here. I think we need the tools from this area. Pretty sure that's how all the other ones work. Appreciate that, Hydrate.
Nice. Uh, is there like a stone? Let me see, what is this? Cobblestone. Okay. Ooh. Isaiah, can I name the flying cow? Mochi eight sus. We do need to go get the cow. Because we did get another saddle, so we should definitely go get the cow from uh, the flying dimension, the flying whale thing. Uh, but as far as naming the cow goes, it's honestly whatever name sticks out the most. Ooh. That's definitely a boss battle. Because uh, the last boss that we fought was in one of those towers, too. One in the chat if y'all want to go to that tower and fight a boss. Two if y'all want to look around somewhere else. Because the last boss we tried to fight did not go well. At all. Went very bad, actually. Y'all just want me to get packed up, huh? Okay. Alright. I think we should bring a waste though then, no? Waypoint, uh, blue portal. Well then we need to go make, um, we have to go make a portal or a waste on thing. We should start going to other dimension. That one's got its own sound. They all got their own little twinkle twinkle to the sound effects, but that one's kind of like ear piercing. Um, I think we need one more pearl to make the uh, the thing that we need. And we got power two. Oh, we got two power twos. Will that work if we put them together? Hour three. Nice. Ooh. Okay, we don't have enough for this. We need 12 levels. But that'll be good when we put it together. All right, so we're gonna go to, we're gonna go to the nether. We'll get an enderman pearl, make a waystone, and then we'll go to the boss. Didn't the waypoint not work in the last dimension? No, I think it does. Because we TP'd from the nether back to our house. So it definitely should work. Um, but we do need an enderman somewhere. Alright, there we go. One enderman. I am ready. We got two. Okay. So we should have... I think we have everything. I don't remember exactly what we need. What is your face cam? Sony A6400. 90% sure that's what it's called. Yep, that is what it's called. Appreciate that, Sheets. Okay, so what do we need for this thing again? Waste on. Okay, so we have everything in there except for an emerald. And it's thundering. Does that mean my house is gonna catch on fire? Why is the portal blocked off? You know, at this point, honestly, it's not even we can take away the block because I feel like we're strong enough now. Warp stone. And then we need stone bricks and obsidian. Uh, boom. 
New waystone. Make a couple lightning rods and put them around the base. How do you make a lightning rod? Three copper. Okay. Boom. All right, we got three of them. Is that enough? I don't know where to put these because I don't know how they work, but. Do you put them on top of the stuff or just like around your builds? Put it on the grass. Oh, so it goes to the rod. So it pulls stuff away from. Oh, OK, I see. I thought if. Oh, I'm glad I did not put it on top of the house. Let's see if lightning strikes. Put one more over here. Boom. All right, so our house should be good from lightning now, I think, right? You might need a couple more. All right. But I only got one more copper though. So we can just make one more and put it like behind the house or something. You know, I just realized I'm pretty sure we have a bunch of those uh, faster furnaces. I forget what they're called. I'm pretty sure we have a ton of those sitting inside of one of our uh, crates here. Like 90% sure. Yeah, the blast furnace. I just have not used it yet. put this here oh it's a wandering villager dude wait maybe we can buy something from him oh no okay all right it's time to go to sleep pickpocket him wasn't that one of the there's like an achievement for that or something how do we pickpocket him? Did that thing just shoot an arrow back at me? Uh oh, never mind. That's the arrow coming back down. Okay, Mr. Wandering Villager, where are you? I see him. How do you pickpocket him? Pathfinder what kind of MOD is this? Uh, it's called Better Minecraft. Ooh, glowworm silk, willow sapling. I don't know what any of this stuff is, to be honest. I'm gonna go get some emeralds and we'll buy something from them. Just because I've never seen that stuff before. Pack him up, is that? Oh, if we we pack him up, he'll give us the... Uh... We have to punch him to get that? To pickpocket him? Oh, I did not mean to do that many emeralds. Oops. All right. All right, well, I'm gonna buy from him first just in case it doesn't work. And then, then we'll, I guess, beat him up. Pathfinder Quill. No idea what that does. Uh, Palm sa Sapling looks kind of cool. Sure. 
Thanks, sir. All right, we got two glowworm silks. Don't know what those do either, but. Oh. Okay. What? Wait, wait a minute. Hold on. So this glowworm stuff gives us a basic iron chest plate. Is that what I'm reading or is there like something different here? Crouch and right click. That sounds better. Okay. Maybe I gotta get behind them. Oh. Huh? What the? What the? <laughs> what did I do? You're coming with me. <laughs> We're gonna tangle to the house. You're coming with me. You're gonna stay in here. I don't even, I guess if I crouch and right click, it just snatches the humans. What on earth? I'm not a wandering villager anymore. He's just my villager. Ain't right. no way you picked up mans that way. Mochio eight sus mochio eight sus mochio eight sus me next. So what do I do with it? I didn't know this was possible. And I don't know how to pickpocket him. Is there a way to pickpocket you? Hold on. Oh. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe we just gotta punch him. Hey man, I'm sorry about that. All right, man. Uh, well, he's just gonna chill in the house. You know, I'm curious about something. If we can pick him up. Okay, all right. I just wanted to see if we could like put him on a fence post to keep him safe. That's all. It's the carry on mod. I think you can pick animals and stuff up too. What? Wait, let me pick a llama up. Hello, little llama. <gasps> a llama. Let's go. I'm going to reunite you. Here is your owner. There you go. Welcome to my house, Mikasa is tu casa. Enjoy, be careful for the fire. Um, you're welcome to walk around, just be careful for the, the razor blade and the, the fire, okay? My house isn't really baby proof, so. What were we doing before I just got distracted? I'm, oh, we were making a waystone. Okay, so we should be good now. I think we got everything we need. Oh yeah, the other llama. I didn't forget about you. Take you to your buddy. Mi casa es su casa. Yeah, not tu casa. Thank you. Clear inventory. Good idea. All right. Um, what do we need to put up? I want to keep the new stuff I just got. So I remember to try this out when we get back. So we're going to keep that. Okay, I think that's everything we need to put up. Stone axe. Yep, that looks good.
Boom. Yo, turtle with the resubscription. It'll be two months. I could have swore I said that earlier this stream. Am I tripping right now? Maybe I'm bugging. I swear you uh, subbed up earlier and it popped up. I'm tripping. Appreciate that resubscription though. I don't know why it just said it. Okay, so it did happen. I'm not tripping. All right, so we need to go back. It did it earlier. Yeah, she, see, I'm not tripping. Why are you trying to make me look like I don't know who subbed up and who didn't? All right, so we're gonna go to that over there. I'm guessing this is a boss fight. Definitely a, what is that? All right, is it friendly? Hello, sir. Azulfo, are you friendly? My name is Crip. What's your name? All right, they're friendly, cool. What is that? Is that a, I think that's a ram. Hello, a stardust ram. Can I pick Picky it up? Top. Yeah. Hey, we got a ram. Yeah, I think I could pick up one of them big, uh, the big ones up there. I mean, we picked the llama up. Nope, it's too big. Too big, too heavy. All good. What the? Okay, let's go to the tower. I mean, we really didn't need to bring a waystone, considering how close we are to the tower, but why not? Picking up animals is crazy. I mean, I think it's kind of cool though, because you could do it IRL, so it makes sense. All right, so there's probably strong dudes in here. We're gonna call this Blue Tower. Um, so I gotta make sure that they don't pack us up here. No turtle with the gifted. Appreciate that, man. W's in chat for turtle, appreciate that. Okay, so this is the exact same setup as the purple building, which means there's probably keys in here. Is he in a different realm? Uh, yes. So this is called Ever... Ever Bright. This mod thing has like five or six different realms. I don't know about you, but I can't pick up a llama IRO. I mean, I could pick a llama up. I don't feel like that's too heavy. How much they weigh? Like 200? Oh, hello. Thank you, sir. Water cauldron. Don't think we need that. Can we poison? other things like during this boss fight could i throw the poison at the boss or is that not possible oh there was a key thank you what do you bench i couldn't tell you right now i'm not gonna lie i haven't um hit a bench max in like three years my last bench was um i think it was 225 which is pretty good considering my weight. It's not crazy though. But I'll probably say if I was the bench right now, I'm definitely not doing more than 170 for sure. For a fact. Take the lights. I don't know if it'll let us break blocks here. Llamas weigh 300 to 500 pounds. 
Oh yeah, we can't break these because it's like a tower thing. I mean... Do y'all think the... We should make um, a sword out of the stuff from this area? Is that going to be stronger than a diamond sword? Yeah. Because I know they want you to like make stuff with the area that you're in. But I don't know if it's going to be stronger. Alright, we'll do it. What is that? Oh my gosh. It's a prowler. You're friendly, right? All right. What the frick is that? Okay. All right, sent him back to wherever he came from. RIP that thing. What is that? Like a fairy. Uh huh? Yo, Joe with the big five gifted. Appreciate that, man. Those in chat for Joe. Appreciate the five gifted. Okay, so this is what we just got. We got a monkfish don't know what that is a star flare which makes a star emitter that that's kind of cool maybe it's just like a cosmetic thing and then a soul fragment which makes a warding pearl don't know what that does but it seems cool Uh oh, gifting ward. Yo, Chronic with the five gifted as well. Appreciate that, Chronic. Big five gifted from Chronic as well. Appreciate that, man. That was in shot for Joe and Chronic with the five gifted. All right, I'll put this stuff up. Um, Put everything in the backpack for now. That way we have space for this boss fight. Uh, What else do we need? Get this? wood to make tools, lol. Oh, yeah, I got distracted. There was something else I think I needed. Oh, keys. All right. Make the tools. We're just going to make a stone axe. Or a stone sword. Maybe that'll be stronger than a diamond one. Probably some leather boots so you don't sink into the snow and freeze. Got you. Yo, Chronic with uh, another one. Appreciate that gift to him. Appreciate that. W's in chat for Chronic. Okay, so crafting table. Then we need stone. I wonder if there's a. Uh, there's probably ingots in here, right? That would be better than stone. Because there was some in the other dimensions. But I don't know if it's worth it to go looking for that. Boom. Okay, so we got a stone pickaxe, stone sword. It says it's the same damage, but I think maybe it does more since it's from this dimension. I don't really know, though. Oh, and then let's make more bread. And we should be good to go. The red things you got are ingots. Oh, they are. Okay. But is this even worth it here? I mean, it has a two next to the two next to the knife thing on the screen so and this only has a 1.6 so i think it's probably stronger than right red stuff is right oh i didn't even see that thank you 
I was re-watching one of the episodes from your last series and came across the one where you have like 50 gifted subs in like 15 minutes and you were begging people to stop gifting. Yeah, I mean, because when y'all just, when y'all start sending stuff crazy, bro, like I appreciate it, but y'all don't have to send, you know what I'm saying? Y'all don't have to drop like 50 gifted, 100 gifted and stuff, you know? But I do appreciate it um, for anyone that wants to support the stream. Should we make, I think we should make a helmet. What do we not have on? What is this? Okay, what does this mean? Two armor. What's the other stuff? The zeros. One armor. Yeah, I think we're good. As long as we got the sword, we should be good. All right, y'all ready to go fight this boss? Matter of fact, for the Twitch people, um, Moz, can we put up a prediction for beating the boss first try? If uh, y'all have faith in me, let's do it. It's TikTok, if y'all want to get in on the prediction, there's like little predictions you can do on Twitch where you bet like channel points from watching the stream. If y'all want to get in on a prediction, I recommend coming to Twitch because I can't do it over there. We got full diamond armor. We do, but our helmet is different. All right. Oh, we still need two more, um, two more keys. Oh no. All right, that's the strong guy. Another one. There should be another key somewhere here. I already looted that. In general or in one try? One try. So we're gonna do first try here. I think it took us five or six tries to beat the, the first boss that we beat, so. Just a heads up. Oh, we got some armor. They're trying to get us right. Well, if they're giving us red armor, we might as well just make red armor all the way around then. I feel like. Key. Alright, there's one more I key. I think Crypt Menti can pick up baby llamas which weigh around 15 to 30 pounds. I didn't say baby llamas, I was talking about llama llamas. Red pajamas. Yo, girly girl with the five string streaks, W5. I think that opens something. Knockback, quick charge, and protection. Okay. Sharpness too. Nice. Oh, I left my sword. Thank you for letting me know. Sharpness, power. All right, we got everything we need for the boss fight now. Except for our sword. I don't know where I put it though. Oh, okay, I see what happened. Well, since we have... Oh, I can't build here. I was going to say we could make the red, like red boots or something, but we can't make anything right now. All right, y'all ready, man? Is this modded or is this Minecraft nowadays? This is modded. Mod pack is called Better Minecraft. All right, there we go. Boom. This should be everything we need. Let's do it. Leather boots. Is the room made out of snow or something? Is that why y'all saying that? I, 
because we have boots on. Let's do it, man. Hmm? There we go. Alright, summoner. So we have to figure out what he does. Oh, okay, so he summons. Oh. Alright. He lights stuff on fire, too. Oh my gosh. I'm flying. I know. I know he packed me up. You don't have to say anything, buddy. I, I understand. Oh, was that you? <sighs> okay, so... I want to say we need to learn what he does there, but he did so many things at one time. I don't even know what just happened. He summons golems, throws Goku balls, and is Thor at the same time? I have no idea what I'm supposed to do about that situation. I don't even think we did damage to him. I hit him at least two or three times, right? Oh my gosh. I forgot to put our XP up. So we just lost levels. It's fine though, because we made the XP farm thing. Alright, for my smart people in chat what suggestion what suggestions do y'all have i don't even know what he just did to me like it doesn't even seem like my sword was working at all throw the potion at him don't get packed up be goku at this point Pray or something. Alright, man. I don't even know if that landed. What are these dudes doing? And why is there so many of them? I think I just gotta stay away from those. Wait. Okay, I see. So these guys, the green ones, shoot stuff. Um, the other ones I just have to stay away from, I think. Why does he move so fast? Maybe I can't touch them until I get rid of the other guys? I don't get it. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's get rid of these dudes. I can. Yo, MA, our mall stat with a resubscription. Our first time sub, actually. Appreciate that, man. Toby's in chat for mall. Okay, we're just gonna have to take it slow. I need to watch out for the dudes that shoot stuff. I think this is winnable. I just need to play smart. Why does that ball go through the, the poles? So yeah, I can't, I can't get to that guy without getting ready to get the minions, is what I'm seeing. Because you can only get him while he's bringing people in. It's 
So it's really just we just have to keep moving. I mean, we're a fourth of the way. Maybe winnable. I just don't know if my sword is going to last that long, to be honest. He's spawning more. Go, go, go. There's so many of these things. I can literally only get to him when he's spawning stuff. If I had more golden apples, I would say maybe, but yep. Let me eat. No, I couldn't. I couldn't eat. Really. Why they always got something smart to say whenever we come back? All right, so oh the bow. Okay, so what about apples and bow? That might work because we can't get close to him without having to pack up all the little dudes. So I think we need third times the charm. I think we just have to get rid of the green golem dudes that shoot arrows run away from the mini ones and shoot the bow i feel like that should work oh and we do have that book that's a good idea from the first boss that we fought uh what was that thing called a scroll yeah this is from the first boss that we fought this will be helpful. Yeah, apples and strength potions. I don't think we have strength potions. Healing, swiftness. Yeah, we don't have that. And we don't have like a a brewing station set up just yet does it work in that world uh it does i'm gonna assume i don't know for sure though all right let's make more apples is it worth all of our gold i don't know but if we beat it then it is come Oh, uh, we do. Yeah, we do need to make another sword as well. Blue tower. One in the chat if y'all think we got it this time. Two if y'all think I'm definitely getting packed up. I mean, that was 50%, but I did have to eat like mad apples, to be honest. I think it's winnable though. We got enchanted apples this time. And then we're gonna make... Oh, we can't build stuff here, can we? Are we gonna make a new sword? This one's about to break. Oh, did our helmet break? No. That was a brand new helmet. Oh. Arrows? We just need one, I think, because we have infinity. 
make two swords. I don't think we have enough for two. Uh, what is this thing? Okay. We need... Yeah, I think we should make another sword out of the red stuff or boots. One in the chat for sword, two for boots. Our boots are on 6%. I guess we need a helmet technically. Sword? Yeah, I'm saying sword. Sorry for wishing for your demise. Oh, we should bring uh like the special arrows. That's a good idea. Whoever just said that Flacco. That'll be idea. Okay. Uh yeah, we'll make we'll make the sword. Boom. Two swords then. That should be enough to get rid of them. Yeah, we have our bow, our apples, our potion, our scroll, and our food. I think that's everything, right? Oh, the only thing is we can't use the infinity with like special arrows, right? We got instant damage. Don't know if that's good. Slowness. I think that's all we got. As far as things that would be helpful. Oh, what about these things? What about ancient darts? We've gotten these before. But I don't know what they do because we've never tried using them. And it doesn't say anything about it. Ancient dart. I don't know if that works, but we'll bring it. And I don't know what order it shoots stuff out at. But we'll try it. Helmet. And I think we're good. Alright, let's do it. Back for vengeance. Boots. Excuse me, sir. Uh, we only have golden boots. Do we have diamonds? I think that's our last four, though. So we're going to have to take a mining trip. Alright, now let's do it. Chest slash crafting table mod name. Uh, I have no idea what it's called. I think it's like some network thing. Storage, simple storage network. That's the name of that mod. All right, we should be good. arrow I'm shooting oh no all right yep we're just gonna go ahead and use that off rip no way he dodges arrows you're lying okay he does he yo nah bruh that's ridiculous. All right, I got something for you. That did not work. Come, so we're just gonna have to do the same thing we did the first time. That doesn't reach far enough. I think this will just be good to get rid of the, the minion dudes. Yeah.
It doesn't one tap them though. He dodges the arrows, so there's no point in doing that one. Um, the only time you catch him with the arrows is if he stands still while he's bringing somebody. Or in the back, though. I just needed to move better there, I think. I have a pink chest plate. Uh, it's a modded Minecraft. Shoot as many as while you run, so you don't have to keep hitting them. Well, the issue is that he's also shooting like some fireball thing at us. So I have to also make sure I'm not running into them and dodge that thing at the same time. We should be good here though. Um, let me put this stuff back on. I think that's everything. The squirrel is low key, not that helpful. Cause it doesn't reach him also i don't know how to make sure we're using a specific type of arrow i don't know if there's a way to do that nice He is too fast, bro. I think it might just be better to just go for the hits. Get rid of the green first, then go for him. Dodge the orbs, get the greens. Eat food at the same time. Only thing is that ball, that orb thing, like, Hits you even when you're not right next to it. Bruh. Do it. I mean, I could maybe just keep spamming this. I don't think it's doing that much damage though, compared to the sword. I think the bow's doing any good damage. I mean, it's doing a little bit. I like the sword. Yeah, the sword definitely does more. There we go. It's a little bit of damage, almost halfway. He's calling more. So I just gotta watch for whenever he's getting more minions and then go attack him. Oh no. The fire stuff does a lot of damage. What's he doing? Oh, they're red now. Why are they red? That's not good. Oh, they do more damage? 
I don't really want to find out to be honest. Let's pull in some more. Winnable. Winnable. Uh oh. I think he's like healing himself or something. I just spawn more. No. I think he's healing. Not gonna lie. He just got his health back. Maybe the red one's healed. Maybe. Alright, two more of those. Like good attacks and it's winnable. Oh no. 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 Oh man. I got cornered. Like rule number one of zombies. The pink bubbles are him healing. Oh, okay. Alright, we get we, we got it on his time. We got it on his time. That was super close. Only thing is we're kinda low on on apples now i wonder if his scroll like after we beat him is gonna be minions i can tell you never went high rounds on world of war well it's a little bit different when there's a thing shooting balls at you across the room zombies are a lot more simple than us I don't have to worry about uh um, might not be able to beat this boss. You might need Goku on this one. Okay, some of y'all ain't been around for the uh quoting phase on this uh on these streams. But uh some of the OGs, y'all know when people start down, y'all get uh get quoted in chat after I tee up so you'll be getting quoted after this all right are we good now I think we're good do it I think strength potions would actually be mad helpful in here. I feel like I'm missing something in my inventory right now. Like I'm not healing even with full health or full food. damage
No, he's healing. Can you enchant those swords? Um, I don't know. That's a good question. Why am I flying? Stop the healing. I need him to heal or call some other stuff. There he goes. Meter. He's literally one tap. And he just got health. Nice. Come on. Move. Oh my gosh. Zaps if I get close enough. Bruh. Heal. I think I gotta get rid of these guys. His timing is just too good right now. No. I mean, there's no way he should be alive, right? Yeah, he's healing. I'm stuck. There is no way. So the bag. Was he not zero HP on his health bar twice? Am I tripping? He was zero for so long. What, twice though? Burn it back. No apple run. I could understand like once, like if it was once he was one HP, that would make sense, but somehow that happened twice where he had no health on the bar, but he was still still alive. Make some potions. Uh, we don't have a brewing stand though. That's the only thing. That probably would be helpful. Try to enchant. Yeah, we'll try. One in the chat if y'all think we can get him without any, without any chance and apples. Two of y'all think we definitely need to go get that. I think I can do it. I don't know, actually. Them apples were kind of saving us. <laughs> the apples were kind of clutch there. All right, you know what? We'll play it safe, man. Also, the swords are all getting low. Uh, 
I don't need know if I need to go get more or what, but more of that stuff, but Okay. Well I think we're completely out of apples. Good idea. Combine. Apple. No more apples. Um three apples. You think if I'm fast, maybe I can reach him with the swiftness? Huh. I mean, I could work. What else do we need? We have no more gold. We used it all on the other apples. What are the white apples? I could not tell you. I don't remember how we got them. What's that place called? Ever something? Skies? Ever bright. Yeah, I don't know what the white apple does. Let me see. Remedy. No idea what that means. Huh. I mean, maybe it's like a heal. It wouldn't hurt. Um, what else do we need? So we have brewing stands. We just haven't used them. Do we have nether wart stuff? Not in here. We got the warts. We got the water. So what would be the best thing to take? I think we do have more gold in here, actually. 27. And we got four gold blocks. Boom. All right, nine apples. Regeneration or strength? Resistance three, strength two. Press and appreciate the roses. Strength and speed. How do we make strength? Oh, we need blaze rods for this. Luckily, we did find some yesterday. Okay. Uh, blaze powder. So how do you make, uh, well, I guess it's, it's probably in here, huh? Strength. Oh, it's a blaze powder with another blaze powder? What on earth? Okay. Oh, we need another one. Blaze. Was it a powder? Yeah, it's a powder. Okay. Uh, probably should get a third thing, huh? A third bottle. Add some rest on to make it longer. Good idea. How do you make the bottles again? Oh, spots are wrong. Three, okay. All right, so we'll do, we need the water. Three in that, three in this. One more here. Blaze in there. Will it go into a normal water or does it have to be awkward first? I used to watch it in middle school. What's good with it, man? Only loyal men play Minecraft while they girls sleep. I 
guess it has to be awkward. Mm. So which is, which is better? To redstone it or to make it stronger with gunpowder? Because I think the gunpowder is what makes it stronger, right? Oh, glowstone. Okay, so yeah, we just need a glowstone. We do not have any of that. Redstone since he disappears. All right, we'll keep, we'll make the first batch, the normal kind with redstone and then make the other one the strong. Why is this not working though? What the? Yo. Yo, back up off the uh, potions, bro. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. Yo, y'all good? Where'd this third llama come from? Yo, we can be chill about this. I know what. I don't know how to calm them down, but I don't think there's any way to calm them down. Only know you love them when you let them go. Sorry about that, man. Something's not adding up. There was a second wandering dude in our house that just randomly showed up. All right. Don't know how that happened. What's wrong with this? Oh, I see. Awkward. We throw blaze powder in there and then we put a glow snow and we should be good. The storage mod is called network. Hold on. Simple storage network. Okay, so gunpowder. And then we should be 100% able to take this dude on. Hopefully. We don't have like the good apples this time, but I feel like we can still handle it maybe. Alright, so these are a minute and a half long. Let's do sword, bow, secondary sword in case the first one breaks. Sorry, I'm late. Can you restart the stream? For sure. Alright, we should be good. Keep the swiftness too. All right, hopefully this works. I should make regen potions. What do we need for that? I don't think we have that. I don't think we have a gas tier. Oh, our chest plate is cooked. Regeneration stone. What is that? We need one of those. Don't eat the white apples. It takes away the other potion. Okay. Do we have a gas tier? We do not. And we only need one arrow. All right, well, our chest plate is going to break. So I'm gonna put our normal one on. And yeah, let's do it. This is for all the marbles. Oh, 
helmet. Yeah, our helmet is low. I don't think we had a secondary one, though. That's the only thing. I think we got it. The strength potion should be able to let us beat him faster. Pack him up faster. And then... Um, <laughs> As long as the apples give us a little bit more health, then we should be good. Let's do it. Swiftness. Boom. Strength. Boom. Why do I feel like I'm losing my health super quick already? Oh wait, that's actually mad helpful. Apple. That, uh, that blue line he does is so strong. The, like, Goku ball thing. And I have to, like, go different directions. Wait, he's already at halfway? Come on, Earth. Move. No. Focus on bro. Apples aren't even healing me that much. Right, let me get rid of the minions. Because they make it difficult. Two, three more hits. Get out the corner. Stop healing. So I gotta get rid of the little dudes. Bam. Was that fourth try? Four tries the the charm. W chat for saying use potions. Cause we definitely would have went back and got packed up if we didn't. So shout out to y'all. Okay, so we got a loot bag and another trophy. Let's see what's in the bag. Ethereal Arc, 10% movement speed. Okay. I think we just put that on our, like, yeah, we just put this on here. Boom. Hey, okay. Uh, we got a soul bound spear. No way I joined back the moment you finished the boss. My phone died and couldn't watch it. Crying face. Crying face. Damn, man. Well, we got him. Can I put mending on this? Because this is kind of fire. 
I mean, it's basically just a trident, but maybe it does more damage than the trident. I don't really know. All right, and then we also got Moonstones, a Queet. Don't know what a Queet does, but cool. And a music disc. And a star flare. Cool. You gotta get some titanium armor. It's easy to get. Yeah, I have no idea what's good and what's not. I'm kind of just thugging through stuff with the diamond right now. Let me see titanium. I don't even see that. What is this? Meat shredder? With the right ingot. What? Yo, there's some crazy stuff in this. What about, okay, if I just type in leggings, what's like the most, the strongest one? At the right. Fiery leggings? Fury leggings? You get those from the forest? The twilight forest? So I guess the Twilight Forest just got like good stuff, huh? You made a sword out of a queen for the last boss. Oh yeah, we did do that. Can I ask how long you've been a streamer for? Um, Consistently like almost two years, I think. Okay, so boom, we got some good stuff. I think we need to get mending for multiple reasons because we have a really good sword, a really good diamond pickaxe, and now we have this thing. I want to see how much damage this does. Matter of fact, just really quick, we're going to go down to the XP farm thingy. Oh, it's dark in here. I don't think... I think we made it too low. Oh, there we go. Okay, so it doesn't do that much damage. But maybe it's good for, like... Just chucking something if you want it to be far. Don't you get XP from bosses? I guess not, because we're level 0. Yeah, we didn't even get XP for all the little minion things. Oh, I think all our XP went to our pants. Because there's no way we'd have zero XP. Well, all right, man. That'll be the episode today. Uh, went to a new dimension. Packed up a new boss. Oh, I forgot. Hold on. Blam. The alchemist and a summoner pretty cool um w episode